What's going on guys, BQ Aggie back again to bring you another video. This is my holiday, Christmas, uh, mail haul, uh, what have you. Uh, finally back in town from the Christmas break. Uh, I was up north uh, in the Denton, uh, Dallas area visiting my family um, for the Christmas break and now that I'm back home I would like to show you guys what I was able to acquire in the mail as uh, I came back from the uh, break there was quite a few packages in the in my mailbox sorry if I sound a little stuffy a um, little under the weather but uh, anyway let me show you some things that I was able to pick up um, I guess over the Christmas break as as I was away First up is a trade that I did off of Klutzenchar.com with MoonEyes67, and I picked up an older, um, I think this is a 2002 Titanium, uh, private stock Titanium, jersey card of Mike Madonna. And then I also got uh, a mirror red dual jersey of Zach Parisi, a Parkhurst rookie, Zach Parisi. SP game used jersey card of Zach Parisi and then an upper deck ice dual jersey of Zach Parisi so thank you very much Moon Eyes 67 up next is a trade that I did off of Hobby Insider with Howie 10 and I picked up a upper deck exclusives number 49 of 100 of Mike Madonna and then a upper deck game jersey card of Mike Madonna. So thank you, Howie Ten. <clears throat> and some group break results from uh, Klutz and Chara. I joined a um, small group break that uh, Brad put together of 0708 products and uh, decided to jump in and I got the Dallas Stars. Um, I got a couple of miscellaneous, you know, like insert cards and stuff, but the two bigger hits were a Be A Player Signatures autograph card of Yetta Lettinen. And then Sabrina loved this because we hit uh, pretty nicely on PC. This is from 0708 SPX. It's a jersey and patch autograph number two of 25 of Marty Turco very nice patch right there so Sabrina was very very happy that I was able to hit that in the group break so for once Dallas picking Dallas uh, as my PC team in a break pays off um, and then the rest oh no I'm sorry um, this is a trade off of Klutzenchar.com with Jake Gardner fan picked up a new wave autograph from this year's titanium of Adam Enrique <clears throat> and then another trade off of Klutzenchar.com with uh, Veyu QC picked up a Ultimate Patches uh, number 14 of 35 of Zach Parisi and then a Contenders Rookie Autograph of Adam Henrik so thank you Eric appreciate that and then the rest of these are all eBay purchases I picked these up at incredibly great deals uh, they were all very, very cheap and affordable. Um, so I will show you what I was able to pick up. First up is an 0607 Ultimate Signatures autograph card of Mike Madonna. Next up is a three card lot that I picked up from a uh, seller that was just getting rid of some Ultimate Collection. These are all from 0506 Brendan Morrow. Whoa! Marty Turco. And Mike Madonna. So very happy to pick those up. And then I picked up a Panini Prime namesakes, the letter E, number 2 of 75, of Louis Erickson. I'm sincerely thinking about spelling out B Q Aggie, B Q A G G I E, and if I'm going to do it, I've got the E mode down. Um, the Q is obviously going to be the hardest one um, because I only have the option to choose between Quick and Henrique, 
Um, luckily, the the Q and the Henrique is not a short print, so I might be able to go after that. Uh, the Q for Jonathan Quick is the short print, so it just really depends upon how lucky I get for pulling either one of those. Uh, surprisingly enough, the B is actually going to be kind of um, hard to get because, um, not to sound too narcissistic, but I do kind of want to spell the username BQ Aggie with halfway decent people. And I'm sorry to any uh, Rudblad fans out there, but I'm not going to take a B um, from David Rudblad and spell out my name. I'd like to get it, you know, with uh, either somebody like Dustin Brown, who of course is a Cup champion and a Team USA member, um, possibly even Sidney Crosby, since there's a B in their name or in his name. Um, you know, just kind of names like that. So um, I'm thinking about it. I haven't decided 100% yet if I'm going to do it, but. Uh, if I do, I got the E mode down. All right, anyway, moving on. Last pickup that I did personally. Got this off of eBay, number 13 to 25. This year's Dominion. It's an autographed patch of Mike Madano. And that patch is just absolutely gorgeous. <clears throat> and the best I can make out of this is if I turn it this way, um, it looks like the bottom part of the nine, like the crook of the nine. Um, if it keeps going up this way, and circles around number nine. I could be completely wrong, but I think that's kind of what that uh, what that patch is from. Uh, so yeah, but anyway, that's it. That's my mail haul for the Christmas break. Um, I should be getting a few more packages in uh, momentarily uh, within the next week or two. So um, always please make sure to tune in for my latest videos and. Um, might actually have a box break or something here coming up. Who knows? Uh, just really depends upon uh, uh, if Santa's going to be making any late house calls. <laughs> but uh, that's it. Thanks as always for tuning in. Please go check out ClutesandChard.com. Always support your local card shops. And we will see you guys on the flip side. Take care. Happy holidays. Be safe. Happy New Year. Merry Christmas.